corruption is not just rampant in the public and the private sectors. It is enmeshed in our everyday human interactions. We even use coded language or other euphemisms to conceal our misdeeds. Cold water. Gato. Flexibility fees. My favorite. De contra you see in our technique. We often point the finger at our government, <laughs> failing to realize that corruption begins in the home. That corruption begins in the community. That corruption is a function of both poverty and greed. And that a corrupt regime is a reflection of a corrupt society. We must enforce already sound laws while building additional safeguards to curb corruption. We must strengthen judicial bodies and integrity institutions by populating them with impartial patriots. Name and shame those found guilty of evading public trust. Force them to restitute stolen funds and resources, and then send them to jail. High-level corruption, in particular, is like mass murder. And we must treat it like the egregious crime that it is. Because the rule of law is not some fashionable accessory we put on when it suits us. It is the protective armor that we must wear every single day in our values-based revolution.